we've been waiting, y'all been waiting, everyone's like, where's this rifle at? Wow. Ding. In fact, I was shooting with my eyes closed. Damn! Welcome back to the channel, y'all. Today we are breaking out. That's right, the AR-15 from Brace Built for its first ever episode and debut. Y'all didn't even know what color this thing was until today, and guess what? It is a little bit of a shock, right? This is not your typical OD green, obviously. Thanks to Toby Thomas and also Range Master Matt helping us dial it in just a hair. It's high. Jam-packed episode, we even break out some pistols and we hit the long range, it's a ton of fun. We're gonna cover the full build and specs, but for now, we're gonna jump right into the range, our first firing, Devin's behind the camera, she's shooting it for her first time. Let's get right into it. But yeah, you wanna go shoot it real quick? You wanna tear this up at all? Yeah, we, should, we probably should. Oh shit, what I do wrong? Did nothing wrong. We're having a good time, and uh... Huh? Slide catch on the left side. So one went in the middle and one didn't. But okay. Yeah. We'll call that the second shot. Yeah. You can actually blame it on barrel breaking. Not that it's ever that far off. <laughs> Let me try out this red dot and see what happens. Consistent group? Oh, yeah, it's, it's right at the bottom, yeah. Okay, so low but consistent. That was not terrible. I like the red dot. Uh, so tell me about where'd you get it, tell me about the process, all that stuff. So we got it from uh, Brace Built. Your recommendation, of yes, course, good right? Company. <laughs> uh -huh. And we're actually gonna go with one of their standard colors. So we got uh, AR-15, 556, and we got it in this unique green. This is not your typical OD green, obviously. Uh, we're gonna go with their tungsten color, kind of like a gunmetal gray. I opted for something a little bit different. We're gonna take some heat in the comments, that's okay though. And we got it with some Trigicon sights on top, one to six, as well as an offset red dot. Well, as an offset. Red dot. Holy <laughs> shit! <laughs> offset red dot. As well as a red dot on there, all right? All right, let's all right. see what you got. I like that red dot. Yes, sir. It sounds meaner when you're not the one shooting it. Sound of freedom. The sound of freedom. <laughs> Babe, you gotta fire this thing. You gotta try this out. The rounds I see you hitting are in the center mass, mm -hmm. and Weston's were not yeah, quite as tight. Yeah, yeah. The barrel breaking, Toby. Yeah. We got <laughs> the barrel breaking. So I noticed the way that she grips it is different too. It seems that whatever grip you used was fine for you. Okay. <laughs> nice. I'll take it. What happened with that little guy? <laughs> that was the very We're, first one. We'll just cover him up. That one too. Don't worry about that. We just cover him. Oh look. Toby's not as perfect as he says he is either. I never I oh. never said I was. Oh. In fact, I was shooting with my eyes closed. Damn! That's a technique I've the been feel, working the on. Feel. Oh. Alright, so now the range master at work. You want to tear this up at all, Toby? <laughs> <laughs> and I'm pretty sure that was a, that was a tight group. That was straight into <laughs> one bail, probably. Yeah. What would be really fun for him to do is to do 100 burpees here. Yeah. And then run over to the tower and to put rounds on steel from one out to 400 yards. That would be fun. That would be incredible. Be going. Yeah. So we're going to cut to the 100 burpees. I did not Definitely did that full hundred and did not just drive over here to the long range. But that's what I say about edits. <laughs> that's the beautiful part about Final Cut. Anyways, we're here now, y'all, at the long range, and we're gonna see if we can hit. What do we got? 100, 200, 300. We got, we got all the way up to a thousand. That is a direct center mass hit, sir. Deal. You take it out to two. Sh just second shot, go for it. If you yeah. want, man. Yeah, you yeah, let's go. Bunch of we're having a good time. We're having a good time. <laughs> Dusty Slay. 100 in the sights. I didn't hear a clank. It did not hit. I think it's shooting a little high. Instead of just messing around and trying to zero in it on the on the still range, we'll yeah. take it back and get some paper targets to zero. Okay. So at this point, our 100 yard target, I say we stay on that, have some fun and make some noise. Nice. All right, let's go ahead and uh, Send it. give it a go. Hit. I would say someone's a natural. Dang! <laughs> I might try the two. Oh wait. Did I hit it? You hit it. Was uh, that the 200? Yeah, it was 200. That was the 200. Toby, what's happening? Let's do it again. Hey. Oh. Another. <laughs> what do y'all think about your new toy? Dude, I love this thing. Brace, wow. <laughs> Thing's legit. I've been like looking at it, like it's so pretty. But. Yeah, we've been, we've been waiting, y'all been waiting, everyone's like, where's this rifle at? <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
uh, Toby graciously allowed us to come out here to uh, Battle Springs Ranch in Oklahoma. And uh, you, you've seen us do a lot of fishing out here, mm -hmm. but never any of this. So you're going to have to let us know what you think. I'm asking Toby, like, is there a 500 yard target? And, and it's, there's a deer out there, way out there at 500. Our deer Just the grazing. <laughs> are not, uh, they're not the smartest animals on earth. <laughs> so if I was a whitetail, I probably not would not want to be on a gun range. If you were behind the scope, he'd probably be out of the way, but whenever I line up, he's like, oh, he can't even hit 200. <laughs> Devin's always beat me, whether it's fishing or with the rifle. She's got the bigger PB, she's always catching more fish. Now she's hitting the further targets, so I gotta redeem myself. Oh, yeah, you scared some birds. Miss. <laughs> What's so funny? Where did you aim? I've done gone through three magazines trying to hit this 200. I suck. This is a sweet ass gun. We are just right below the deck and I'd say we're probably at about 75 yards now. <laughs> 200. 200. If I can do it, you got to get through it. All right, let me crank it up. I think I got it that time. Oh, I heard no. a little pew. I heard a little boom. Shy. I think. No, shy. I hear a little ding. What you talking about? I hear the ding. Boom, ding. That's it. Give her the old check. She's looking good. All right, guys. We came to another area of the property, and we are breaking out the pistols. First off, we're gonna break out. This is actually a pistol that we've never shot before. It's the Smith & Wesson m and Shield. Got it, <laughs> got it. Ding. You're gonna have to give it a go. All right, never shot it. Let's see what we got. Woo, ding. Totally missed. There it is. Okay. And we out. Breaking out the baby Glock, Glock 26. Let's go. Clock. That thing's the thing. I want to shoot that too, and then we're wrapping it up. Tenth one's always fun. Deer. Hanging out with us. Wow. We're going to go ahead and fire off the last ten rounds of the day. That's some fun right there. <laughs> I love this little dude. Woo! <laughs> Wow. <laughs> Sick, y'all. All right, y'all, we hope you enjoyed this one. First time breaking out the brace built AR-15. But get this, if we hit 50,000 subscribers by the end of March, I'm actually buying my little sister Olivia behind the camera right now. That's me! Her own rifle. We're going to take her out shooting for her first time with something like this right here, y'all. Be sure to subscribe, and we'll catch y'all on the next one. And honestly, I don't even know what color this thing is anymore.